lost track of time. I'd better go and check on my family. Lars, my teddy bear is missing. But you two are inseparable. When did your teddy run off? We were playing hide and seek in the yard. He usually hides behind the well. He thinks that's a good spot, silly teddy. But he's not there today. We'll find him. Don't worry. Hmm, there's only the teddy bear's body here. A mean crowd tore off the teddy bear's head. How can I make it open its beak? A mean crowd tore... I think the crowd will like a piece of cheese. Now I just need to sew the head back on. Ellie, can I borrow the key to your little cupboard? Maybe. What for? I think it'll speed up the search for your lost teddy bear. Really? All right. Take it. Catch! Did you find... Not yet. A cupboard full of handicrafts. Teddy's back. Time to tell Ellie the good news. Look who I found behind the haycart. Tell Teddy not to play with crowds again. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Sam, come here. Yes, father? It's meant to be a cold night. Be a good lad and chop some firewood. Right away, father. This stamp is where we split locks. It's been here for as long as I can remember. Whew, that's one heavy axe. Father wants me to grow up to be like Hercules. Just need to carry the firewood into the house and I'm done. Done. Good job, son. Put the firewood in the stack by the fireplace. I finished chopping the firewood. Now I can take a break. I 
won't hurt you. It's me, Marta. Remember how much fun we had playing tag last week? I've come to take you back to your family. I have a present for you. See how the pebbles glow. You'll gain power and become a part of a grand scheme. Come out and try it on. If you don't like it, we'll leave. I promise. Ah, my whole body feels shivery, but in a nice way. I feel like I'm the queen of the world. I am pleased to welcome you, sister. But you're not the only child in the family, correct? That's right. I have a brother. Excellent. Where is he? Here. He's right up there. I live in a tree hollow nearby, so I am always on hand whenever I'm needed. A house spirit? I always thought they only existed in fairy tales. My dear Lars, the world is full of magic, but it isn't revealed to everyone. Here, drink this draft of honeyberry. It will calm you and give you energy. Who attacked our house? Oh, Lars! Something terrible has happened. Evil has come to our land. In the last month, children have been going missing, and forest dwellers have been perishing. With a certain diadem, one little girl's mind was enslaved, and now she's gathering a whole army. A diadem? My sister, she... Just put it on. Dark magic. Now she is in the service of evil. Marta, Dorothy, and now Ellie. Things are getting worse by the day. The mystery lies in the butterflies. They are the ones controlling the forest people's minds while devouring their flesh from within. What do we do? How do we save Ellie? Did you see the giant with Marta? Ellie will probably get something like that as a servant. Simply going in and taking Ellie won't work. We need a plan. Go to the town, find my brother. He lives in the tailor's house. He even helps with the sewing and the housework. And he's awfully inquisitive. He's sure to know more than me. Take him some of my very own homemade mushroom cakes. They're his favorite. Thank you, Bakhtun. It was good to meet you. I'll be waiting for you and Ellie. May the forces of nature help you. Judging by the sign, this is the tailor's house. I hope they'll be happy to see me here. It looks like the girls beat me to the tailor's. I need to take a good look around. The house spirit probably hid in time. The 
That's one huge claw. Great idea! If I attach the pin to the end of a spool of yarn, I'll have a rudimentary fishing rod. With this, I can hook onto something and climb up a little way. Letter from a wood fairy. Uh huh, so the house spirit has a hideaway. a good hold. I think I'm going to try climbing up. Kitty, the poor thing is scared out of its mind. It's even afraid of me. All the scary stuff is over now. I'm lost. Backthorn told me to find you. Is he <coughs> all right? Yes, he hid me when I was being chased, and he told me you could help. I have to save my sister. Something terrible has happened to her. Lars, your sister's mind has been possessed by the diadem. I'm afraid that simply taking it off won't be enough. Bakhtorn said you were brave. Well, you're going to need your bravery now. Even my master, the brave Taylor, lost his battle against those creatures. He landed a few good hits, but they just got up and attacked again. I tried to help, but they slashed me with their claws, and I tumbled down into the basement. It seems the girls are hunting boys. Yes, they use them as living cocoons to turn larvae into new magical butterflies. The demon himself is harmless. He hides in a <coughs> cave, and little girls do all his <coughs> dirty work for him. You need to hurry. <coughs> 